what's up beautiful people this is Naruma. welcome to the channel today we'll have this very interesting video and it's titled whoopee canned mm. the view is off the air as host create partition problems with viewers Ooh, wow awesome i'm excited to check this one out to hear what we've got to say let's check it out hey there guys welcome to the channel so sadly I have to report something very, very sad. The view is off the air, which is bittersweet. I'm going to have to dig through the archives to keep picking on our pal Whoopi. But that said, this could possibly be very well be the best news of the summer, if we're being honest. So basically, I guess what's been going on is there's this Writers Guild strike that we're all aware of. Most of us are aware of. It hasn't really yeah. affected our lives any, thankfully. And this also didn't seem to affect the view too terribly much i thought you know it really is just a bunch of old limousine liberal extreme marxists sitting around parroting the day's most vitriolic targeted propaganda but whoever the machine wants to target today that's what they did and while also playing fanboy and apologist for literally anything and everything that the liars cheats and alleged criminals in biden's orbit do or say so not really necessary, I'd think, to have writers for something like that. But I'd guess, honestly, I think that the last straw for producers and when they realized that this just cannot continue without writers was when Whoopi started talking about getting laid in the pool. An absolutely freaking horrific moment. And I could not unsee it or unhear it. I'm not going to play it for you guys because that is not fair. But anyway, also apparently ratings have been slipping because... When they do have Hollywood-related guests on, I guess they're prohibited from talking about any of their projects. Can't talk about anything Hollywood-related or writer-related, strike-related, only books if they have them, and sit around and bitch and moan about Donald Trump or Ron DeSantis, which apparently gets pretty boring, even for the mushy brain viewers of The View. And uh, so I guess people have been complaining about that, and also complaining that without writers, it appears that these fine, fine ladies, they just argue too much. You know, and I didn't even realize that this was a new thing, them arguing too much. But here's one of the better blowouts. It was about Miranda Lambert and the crazy stuff that she did to her, those folks in Vegas. VIP, VIP seats? Yeah, I mean, like you know, literally she can front. see what you're doing and she can see that you're ignorant. It's like, it's like being a lounge singer. You know, you go into a bar, somebody's at the piano and nobody's listening. Yeah. You know, that's what it's like or for you her. Give a I'm just saying. Or like, then give me the respect yes. of watching me while I'm doing my thing. Well, I don't come. Maybe I want to play it again. Well, it doesn't mean you what can't What does that mean? Maybe I want to, I want the, the fit picture and I want the music in the background. Yeah, I'm think okay. they're I'm taking I'll relive it. Themselves. Turn relive on it. the television, girl. Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm leaving y'all. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to take a pic. I'm actually with them on this one, man. You paid to be there. You know, you don't worry about how I watch. You just be glad that I'm here watching. That was a bad look for Miranda Lampert. That was not a cool thing to do. She must have been having a bad day. And that happens. People have bad days. But another great one to witness was the Jason Aldean fiasco. Of course, they had plenty to say about this. Surprisingly, even View fans thought Whoopi was out of touch on this one. Take a look at this, but before we do, guys, thanks to everyone who's been subscribing and uh, leaving great comments. We appreciate the support, and if you haven't already, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Most importantly, share the channel. Really helps us grow, and uh, every time you do one of these things, the leftist loses their wings. Take a look. There's a lot wrong here with this. This is a man who saw what happens when someone is out of control right. with their guns. Yeah. He's he someone who was, he was in performing Vegas, in, Vegas, in Vegas and he was he saw people get so I don't understand how he could be that disconnected, how people around him didn't say to him, hey, listen, you know what? Maybe there's a better way to do this because... Well, the you, imagery invoked I, I, race. That's yeah. what was... It, there's it, no it, reason it to separate race. big city people from small town None. people. That, to me, is the divisive part of this song. I mean, it's a deplorable what? song. and it's. Yeah. So we have a break for these fine ladies. Going into the next season, which is supposed to happen in September. And honestly, I got to say, moves like this situation right here, they usually... This is usually when shows make a, some kind of change. Change their host you know, get rid of the show altogether. That's just speculation. I have no idea what's going on, but this is when they would do it. Like I said, change hosts, cancel the show even, or even likely, you know, ABC's been having very, very serious financial problems 
<laughs> they may even try to find a way to sell the show to a competing network. Mm. And uh, anyway, I just wanted to share the bad news with you guys. Wanted you to hear it from me first, uh, that we got to go at least a month without having to listen to the insanity from Whoopi or Joy or uh, Sunny. Let me know uh, your thoughts in the comments, guys. Wow, I'm sure lots of people are happy that the view is on break, but um, lots of people would be more happier if it's um, canceled. Let me know what. Let me know. Let me know. Um, are you for the view to be canceled, or are you for the view to uh, take the break and um, refresh and come back? Let me know your thoughts in the comment down below. But yeah, speaking of Jason Aldean's song, try that from a small town. I never saw anything in the song that was divisive. There was nothing in the song that was racist. Oh my God, it's how people read every little meaning to something that doesn't even require all of that stress. It was just simple song talking about togetherness. When the song that um, talked about race, when the song was it that even talked about divisive? Oh, the craziness about divisiveness is oh my god, this is insane. But yeah, it's a good thing that the view is on break. Let them use this time to refresh and um, have a good time, and then let them come back before because I never even knew anything about the view. I never, I am not one that would sit down to even watch the show because I never knew about them. But yeah, it was all because of Jason Alden's try that in a small town. So she, they should be even grateful that Jason Alden made me realize or made me know about them because I never knew they existed before. But this, yeah. Um, them talking about um, the song and try that in a small town. Everybody, I don't know anybody who lived in a small town or who has lived in a small town who would say the song is not relatable. Come on, everyone who's listening to the song always shared the exact same thing that the song is relatable and um, they never saw anything about the in the song or in the musical video that talked about race because it seems like maybe they watched a different video a separate video from the one i did because what i did what i saw and what i checked was clearly clearly explain explanatory it, i mean the song itself is well explanatory itself and um it was talking about beautiful community togetherness um people in in smaller towns looking out for their own regardless of what you look like oh my goodness we all can understand and relate and say that um People who live in a small town have got people who got a back. We all can say that. And uh, we all know that um, if you live in bigger cities or if you live in big cities, um, there is, you don't have people who, they, I mean, the beautiful community, you don't have the likes of it in bigger cities because everybody just on their own. Unlike small communities or small towns where you see people who talk upon you, who be there for you, who, um, are always there for you and who have this beautiful community of togetherness i mean come on and let them take a chill pure let them just take a chill and i'm glad that they're on break this will give them a really good time to refresh and um come back and new or a new person if that will help but we're all the same yeah i really love your thoughts and your contribution in the comment down below what are your thoughts about the view and um the whole um the show that is not on air for for now um are you in support that the show be cancelled or are you in support that the show ch change its host or come back with a new theme or are you in support that it should be on break what are your thoughts about it i really love to love to read from you and um you can also share other useful information you think might be really helpful and until next time see you in the next video